What's up, what's up, what's up, y'all? Peace, bless, love. Give thanks to that man above. Welcome to Off Experience Podcast. You rocking with your boy, Mr. Uncommon. The Fresh Prince himself, Izzy Finesse. And your boy, Josh. Remember, y'all, use your experiences wisely. Don't waste your time doing nothing. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, oh sir. Yes, sir. Hey, that was pretty fucking awesome. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Dig let's yes, go. Sir. I felt independent there for a second. You felt it? You felt yeah. it? I felt like I was naked in a, in a street <laughs> by myself. <laughs> Yeah, son. I don't know because there was no music in the background, yeah. but you know, I felt a cappella. You know, I think yeah. we could hold that shit down. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Listen, that shit we, was we, fire. we always try something new. Yeah, you know what I mean. Until we find something new that we fuck with, we like to stick. Mm. We gonna stick with it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. I really fuck with that shit. What's yeah. good, y'all? What's good? Everything bro? good. Everything good. What's good? What's good, bro? What's good? Everything good. good. Oh listen, listen, son. listen. Before, before, before we get into this episode, episode, please, 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 <laughs> like, share. Comment, subscribe. <laughs> what we ask you to do? It's free. It just takes a little movements with the butt, with the finger. That's it. Mm-hmm. Quick, That's quick, it. quick. That's it. Show us some love. Let's just push this algorithm out there. You know what I'm saying? And enjoy the show. Ooh, let's get into it. Drop on for that baby. Boom. So I decided I found a word of the day. Yeah. Hey, what is it today? So the word of the day is purpose. 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 It's a reason okay. to stay alive. That's mm. my definition of that shit. <laughs> a reason to stay alive. I don't care. I, yo, y'all know what purpose is. Something set up as an object or and to be attained. But my definition is a reason to stay alive. I don't know if y'all believe me on that. Y'all agree on no, that? No, I think that should be a fucking purpose. Nah, yeah, that's I agree. a big, yeah. nice purpose. Exactly. Everybody has a purpose in life. Exactly. So that's yeah. why I chose today's word of the day. Be purpose. What so is I your know. purpose in life? Boom. Good question. Good question. Good what question. What is your purpose in life? That's something that you're going to have to put down in the comments, man. We're going to put that out there in social media, too. What is your purpose in life? Word. I feel like everybody be questioning like themselves, like, yo, what's my purpose in life? Like, mm. every day. It's true, right? Yeah. It's true. Like, what, what am I living for? Like, what, it, what, it, 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 what is the saying? Uh, 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 are you amount to something in life? Or, 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 or is there something out there for yeah, you, you in you, life? You was, hit, you was put in this earth for a purpose. Uh-huh. That's, that's the cliche saying, right? You was put in this earth for a purpose. Yeah, it could believe be a, that. You could be a hater. <laughs> you could be a hater. <laughs> <laughs> you could be a motherfucking hater. I tell you that right now because there is a lot of haters, and people live long being a hater. Well, listen, I'll be honest. You do need haters in this world, of course. So if your purpose is to hate, keep on hating, man. Like <laughs> that's your purpose. In life. <laughs> that's your purpose. In life. <laughs> <laughs> we need people like you. You know what I'm saying? Like, Yo, hey. Man. You know what I'm saying? That's, that that's shit, what so. it is, man. But let's say I know. But our main thing right now that we trying to we we are uh, trying to get into is um, a divine intervention, right? Did you mentioned that earlier today on yeah. social media. Let the yeah. people know, son. Divine intervention, man. Like, you know, I'm gonna give it over to Mr. Google's here because. Oof. All right, divine intervention. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all ready for this? Get him! Get him! <laughs> divine intervention. Listen to me, people, for the church. Divine intervention, all right? When the hand of God comes down and stops the motherfucking bullets from hitting you, that's divine <laughs> intervention. <laughs> that's yeah. crazy, bro. <laughs> that's when God comes down yeah. and says, my son, I got you, son. Don't worry about it. I'll hold you down. But anyways, mm-hmm. that's the Urban Dictionary uh, uh, a definition of divine <laughs> yeah, intervention. <laughs> yes, but the real definition is an event that occurs when a deity, God or a God, Becomes actively involved and in changes some situation in human affairs. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with God, not a God. Well, some people believe in a I, God. I believe in the God. <laughs> the God. The God. Yo, the other I don't day believe in too, a God. The other day too, I'm just on Google and like I don't know if y'all have like these times like during the day, but I just be sitting sometimes. I just be googling like the most randomest shit ever. Really? On Google, yeah. I just be asking Google mad I questions. Do, I do that sometimes. And that was one of my questions. I was like, yo, like, what is God? Oh, and then, uh, <laughs> what is God? What is what is, yeah, what is God? It was just like the 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 um like it was just like the higher up of everything, like a belief, <laughs> and it, it was just crazy. And then I um then I started breaking it down, like um how there's like different names, like for instance, like um an atheist, and then he got like other names for it too. And there's like people who who like are in the middle of like does he exist or not. Mm-hmm. And th- like that was a certain name for it. I just can't remember it right now. Mm-hmm. But, they, um, there's there's people that like they believe in like a god. There's people that believe in energy. Yeah. Right. There's people that just believe in the universe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right. 
honestly, I know that mm. that whatever you put out there is what yeah. you, you attract, which is energy. I separate it. That's just me though. Like at one time, I would think it was all the same. Like, but I'll separate it because he's just he, him, just him, mm-hmm. right? What you do, uh, what you put out there is just what you would like to receive back, right? Mm-hmm. That's just that's that's just a person to do something that they would like to have done back to them, yeah. right? So you being a good thing, you get that right back. Mm-hmm. Obviously, it has to do with him, right? Yeah. But I, I, me personally, I would separate it. But there are people like just they believe in God or in the universe. They just and like they in between. Like they even had one too where it was like um you just conscious of like what's right and what's wrong. Mm-hmm. That's people that that live by that too. Yeah. Like righteous. Yeah, yeah, like it was, uh, that was the name for it. That's my whole thing. I'm, I'm always like, that's why I don't go to church. I don't mm-hmm. go, you know what I'm saying? I don't go I'm praise in no way. Like, mm-hmm. I do what I do. I try to live my life as righteous as possible. Of course. And yeah, I do too. You know what I mean, let, let, yeah. let it take its course. Yeah, it's true. You ever had a divine intervention? Woo, shit. I had a whole bunch. Like, let me not say a whole bunch. Like, that sounds like fucking thing. <laughs> I had, <laughs> had a few cl- close moments. <laughs> Real quick, y'all, though. For the people who don't really, really understand what a divine intervention is, Netflix has a show called Manifest, right? If you haven't seen it. It's basically what we're basically talking about, God giving you a calling to help someone or yourself to make sure that, you know, you don't you don't hurt yourself or the person that, that's yeah. that you need to help. So if you check that out on, on Netflix, Manifest, that's a really good show, man. I ain't going to give out too much information because it's a crazy-ass twist, but check it out, man. Inter- uh, a divine intervention is something crazy, so I'm telling you, so. Anyways. Yeah, yeah. So, fucking, uh, um, <coughs> all right, cool. I'm, I'm going to get back to my thing because I'm, I'm, I am I want to get y'all with Because <laughs> I had a few of them, man. Like, and it's scary. It's scary. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, when you start thinking about it, right, I'll give you an instant. I'll give you one story. So, I didn't go to work this day, right? And y'all that are watching, like, yeah, y'all, y'all know the story. Whoever's there, y'all know. <laughs> well, y'all watch this. <laughs> so I didn't go to work this one day. So fuck it, we chilling, we driving around, blah, blah, blah. We had, we had beef with, I'm going to say I was thinking with my man, but we, he got beef, we got beef very, you know how that shit works, bro, like <laughs> back in the days. I don't live that life no more. Listen. Allegedly. <laughs> Allegedly, right? Allegedly. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> so we chilling, it was like maybe like six of us. Blah, blah, we driving, boom. We, we stop at a corner. We see, we see dude crossing the street. Uh-huh. They, had, they already got into an incident with them before. I wasn't there for the first time, right? But since I was there on the second one, it was what it was, bro. Like That's the worst. It, it yeah, is that, the worst. That should be the worst. Like yeah. Thinking about it now, it be because <laughs> what the fuck that has to do with me? Yeah. But since I'm, I'm chilling with That's fine. my crew, right? Mm-hmm. Did you like think in your mind, like when, like when you seen that they seen him, did you think like, oh, oh man, man. <laughs> we about to get into some shit right now? I'll be honest. <laughs> On on that time, on that time back then, bro, like you was nah, just ready. I was just, just ready. it was just it was like, just go like yeah. fuck it. This is what it is, bro. Like, you know what I mean? Which is a dumb shit to fucking do. Listen, mm-hmm. I'm gonna tell y'all right now, that's the dumbest fucking thing to do. All right, if you're gonna be around people that's always gonna be into some shit, then you might as well not even be around them. You know what I mean? Right. I'm not saying that we was always some shit, but we was always some shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right? So, anyways, so he's crossing the street. My man goes, "Oh, <laughs> yo, that's that's this thing." I'm like, Mind you, the nigga looked in the truck and it's like he saw a ghost. Cause he said he just looked and said, <laughs> like he was like a deer with headlights on, bro. Like he looked, he started running. My man got out the car. Dog, everybody started getting out the car. We drove up to uh uh, we drove, we turned the corner. He ran, he's running to his body. Yo, yo, yo! He's screaming, but he's screaming to, to to his apartment to the dude what was on his apartment. Okay. Second floor, bro. Yeah, yeah. So my man is fighting him. I'm about, yo, the nigga's mad disrespectful. Bro. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. My man swung. The nigga said, weave. Mm. Like, started weave, weave. Like, yo, my man was trying to, he was hitting him. Like, mm. weave. Shit. So, so my man, one, my mother nigga caught him. Pop! He fell. They started jumping. His man on the second floor pulls out the ratchet. Oh, pop, shit. pop, 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 We all there. Pop. They start booking it. They, like, they, everybody start booking it. I'm going to rewind back. when I, remember I said we was driving. Driving. He stopped right at the corner. Mm-hmm. The rest of the dudes got out while there were other fight. They were fighting there. Whatever. The guys that stopped right here. The building's right here. He starts pop, pop. Why am I dumbass? Mm-hmm. Yo. Look, my hands go. Why am I dumbass 
goes. Trying to fucking save the truck for some fucking reason. I have no fucking clue, bro. Instead of fucking running like everybody else did, it ain't even my truck. Mm. <laughs> That's number one. Yeah. Not even my fucking truck. The owner of the truck fucking ran too. No oh God. Right? I'm trying to get in the, get in the truck. I, thank God. He just shooting dead at me. Pop. He had no fucking aim. I'm not going to say he had no aim. That was that man doing his work, man. Like, pop, 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 pop. Got in the car. All I hear is ping, ping. <laughs> Took off, bro. Nobody had their phones. No, not that. It was like pay phones. We had oh, stuff, but nobody had their phones. They left them in the car. Yeah. Trying to find somebody to call. But I'm driving around trying to find it. I couldn't find nobody. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, uh, so we finally, you know, got every, picked everybody up. Everybody, yo, there's like that fucking laugh. Yeah. Ain't nothing funny. Laughing. There was nothing yeah, funny man. about none of that shit, bro. Now, you know where y'all There was nothing up. funny about it. But, like, you know, like, where y'all fucked up, but, like, fucked up at it, though, right? Where? <laughs> Why would all of y'all hop out the car and just leave the car there? Why there wasn't like a driver? A driver. I, 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 just I, to, like, be like, yo, I got the car. Y'all go hop out. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> listen, ask it. Listen. I'm not gonna question. lie though. <laughs> like you know, <laughs> I thought somebody was gonna be like, "What if God told me to stay in this car <sighs> to make sure that whoever needs to hop in the car to go to the hospital, I yo, could be ready?" You know what I'm saying? Be the driver, right? Yeah, come on, bro. <laughs> Hello, but y'all dudes <laughs> all ran out to get some action in. Y'all to niggas. get wow. some action in, left the car just like the truck, just like that, bro. Backfired. Backfired. Yo. And the niggas bucking, bang, 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 <laughs> and hits none of us. Thank fucking God. Like thank God. And yeah. I go save a truck that's not mine, bro. Like, what kind of dumb shit is that, dude? Like, I ain't go. Hold, that was one of the dumbest thing I fucking ever did. Yeah. How old was you at that time? I was probably like, I was probably like twenty three, twenty four. Yeah. That was a. That's crazy. Yeah, that yeah, was yeah. a divine of stupidness. Yeah, 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 bro. Not <laughs> fast, bro. Like, yeah, you crazy, know, and bro. and and. and uh, you a wild dude. It, it's, it, it, it's wild, bro, because it's like I don't, I don't like putting myself in positions like that. Yeah, yeah. this is why I stay away from all that shit. And yeah. and I'm gonna chuck it up to be me young, but I was also stupid. So, so, you, so I don't want to make that an excuse. So yeah. you say this is like a, a miracle that everything went well. Oh fuck yeah. Okay. Fuck yeah, like and that. that's not even that, the only story I got, but yeah, that, that's, that's one of them. That's a that's definitely a divine intervention. Yeah, it's kind of like an eye miracle. opener too. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's definitely an eye yeah. opener. I mean, I have a, I don't have a similar story to that. I have a. I have a story where I remember I was in high school and, you know, you know, me dealing with the shorties and shit like that. You know, I got invited to some girl's crib at night. So I was like, no problem. I got you, shorty. I'll be there. I ain't know her parents was there. Yeah. So she said, climb the fire escape. So I said, climb, <laughs> climb the, the fire, fire escape. escape. I was like, wait a minute. What you want me? <laughs> so are you sneaking me in right now? Are you? <laughs> nigga. What? I was like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Are we sneaking into the apartment? Yeah. I thought I was going to go in the front door. She said, how you going to come to the front door? I'm telling you to come at 12 night. I was like, yeah, you're right. Anyways. So now <laughs> she's telling me, yo, come to the fire escape. So I'm like, all right, cool. So nigga, my heart is racing. The adrenaline is going crazy. Yeah. I'm over here like, yo, I don't know. So her parent, her dad. I knew her dad, but he was a strict nigga. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I know he, if he catching me, it's a wrap for me, son. It's a wrap. OD. Anyways, I, I'm going to get into the crib. So, you know, I'm chilling with her. We chilling, chilling, chilling. You know, I fell asleep. For some reason, bro, something whispered in my ear. Josh, get up. Get up. <laughs> get up. Yo, as soon as I got up, bro, I said, I'm out. I left through the window again. Ten minutes later, my nigga, I get, I, yo, I kid you not, her father walked into the room, son. Wow. And I'm out <laughs> on the fire escape, about to go down the fucking ladder. Nigga said he's nigga. in his boxes, bro. <laughs> nigga. <laughs> he's nah, I, I wasn't in he's my like boxes. <laughs> I was in my tank top. I was in my tank top, though. But I was like, yo, what the fuck? I seen the nigga come in. Yo, he. I was like, oh shit, nigga, you see me like this, lined up between the fucking window sill. This nigga's in the ledge, on the side of the building, looking down like... Son, <laughs> it was the <laughs> grace of God, son, that somebody whispered in my ear and told me, yo, Josh, get up. I love it. Because that right there also, you know where you fucked up at, right? <laughs> <laughs> why are you going to this sleep? This thing is like, everybody fucked up in that, bro. Like, why, like, why are you going to sleep if you I know was, you shouldn't even be there in the I was <laughs> comfortable, bro. I was right, man, comfortable. So I, I would even, yo, my, my all that adrenaline rushing in my nerves, I would, like, wouldn't nah. even have allowed me to even go to sleep nah, in the I was first place. I'd be like, nah, I ain't gonna lie I'm not either, even bro. supposed to be here right now anyway, so for me to go to sleep. I guess so that nut was good, boy. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> 
you bold. Man. I am fetal position and <laughs> all, son. Fetal <laughs> position and all, son. That but motherfucker went to sleep quick, bro. Son, it was, it was, it was yeah, a touch of God, an act of God at that time. Son. Oh my I God, I would have been done, son. Came out nothing, yeah. Shit. Yo, he would have came out. Why you, you? You got the daddy coming out, bro. Can't talk He smells. He smells sex in the air, boy. Oh yeah, nigga. Like, he like kid, like um. What's that movie? Um, uh, house party. Yeah. And he walked in. Smell like puss. He smelled like he went to from. They were from church, coming from church. Smell like no, 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 no. It was a house party. Uh, um, no, 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 no. no. Uh, let's rewind. Let's rewind. Um, boys in the hood. Was it boys in the hood? Boys in the hood. When Q was it Q? Q. Uh, he 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 was. He's, he's saying a story where his dad is giving him yeah. a, a haircut. Mm. He's like, yeah, you know, I went to the oh, house. Oh, yeah, 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 and, uh, yeah, yeah, I was about to get, I was yeah. getting in. Her daddy walked in. He's like, I smell like this nigga walked out, ran out the, <laughs> out the fucking house. Them niggas is crazy over there, bro. Like, <laughs> <laughs> they be crazy. having that sense. Yeah. Right. <laughs> he's, that, that man came in with smell. I was like, Hell yeah, nigga. I was <laughs> jumped out the fire skate. Quick, nigga. I was like, out, nigga. He run out with his clothes. With no, yeah. He ain't getting dressed no nothing. He got a box of his clothes. <laughs> That's something I can say that I can cross on my bucket list, that I did some wild shit like that when I was young. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That whole fire skate. Oh, Juliet, Dow, Ja, Juliet. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Right. Oh, Romeo. You know, shit like that. I got my ass beat for jumping out of fire skate, bro. Right, you see, you wild. Yeah, ass, my mom beat my ass, bro. <laughs> That's fucked up, man. She beat me with a stick too. I ain't gonna. I'm not. Uh, ooh, she beat me with a stick. Bow. The what? super, the super, the super ratted me out, bro. Wow. That's how you can't. Yo, that's I was. How you know. Yeah. Can't trust nobody. Can't trust nobody, bro. Like what the <laughs> fuck, bro. Fuck you, super. <laughs> like yo, he. I. I was. He. Not even. <laughs> she can just say. Yeah, come here. Let, let me talk me. to you. Let me talk to, yeah, let me talk to you real quick. You, you comfortable there? <laughs> Boom. Nah, bro. I'm cutting yeah. this shit. Fucking uh, my mom walk. She walking in the fucking. I hear keys. This day she comes out early, bro. Like my out of my, all my, days. my my brother in law was there, right? <laughs> my ex brother in law was there, and he's he's stalling her, like he's stalling her, so I can fucking get out the fire skin, bro. So he's stalling her route, talking to her. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I mm. jump out. I thought I was safe. Da, da, da. Man, I jumped out. I'm good. Oh, nobody saw me. Whoa, man. <laughs> yeah, I. I come back home. Yeah. I, I was on the floor after that. <laughs> my mom beat my ass, Yo, boy. Like, yeah, look at that. The super had told her that I jumped out because he saw me. <laughs> what a dick, bro. I was like, fuck you. I'm going to got away Yo. with it. But imagine <laughs> if there was phones at that time, though. Somebody should have told, like, could have told you, like, when you was out thinking everything was cool. Like, yo, your mom. <laughs> your mom's coming through about <laughs> yeah, some she shit, she bro. Like, know, yeah. Nah, they, they ain't yeah. telling me. Nah, I wasn't warned, bro. Not but at that time. She didn't even ask you no question. Nah, she asked you no question, bro. She's straight. Bah, bah. I would have been like, yeah, like, what if he was lying? What if, what if that wasn't even me? Yo, listen. Listen, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to tell you the story that a lot of people don't know, bro. Like, just what happened. I walked in. <laughs> my mom just came with a stick. Boom! Just hit me right across, right in my head. Bow! Oh. All I saw was the floor when I did she knocked me out, bro. Uh, started seeing stars. Like, my, my, no, no, I ain't see no stars, man. She uh, knocked me out, bro. Oh, shit. My, my face went like this straight to the wall. The floor, the floor was coming up. Boom! Knocked me out. After that, she was like, <laughs> Who the fuck told you to hit me in my fucking head with a bat? Nigga with a said stick? The, the floor hit him. The floor hit me, yeah. <laughs> I was knocked out, bro. She kept out saying, She's like, Please don't go to sleep. You know? she saw, now, now she's panicking. Yeah. yeah. This is what y'all need to be thinking about before y'all do stupid mm-hmm. shit like that. Mm-hmm. You know I mean, think about the fucking consequences be afterwards. Yeah, it's what happens? It's because parents back then were vicious. That's why mm-hmm. they, they grew up in a different time than what it is now. It's true. You know, like if you hit a kid now, they. They, yeah. they probably freaking yeah. burst out crying, want to call it ACS and yeah, all that. That's, that's why I don't blame her. I mean, it was yeah. fucked up, man. It was fucked up, but I don't blame her. Yeah. I mean, I don't I don't hold it against her. It's not yeah. it's not something yeah. that I'm fucking <laughs> dying over. But it was <laughs> fucked up. I would never do that, but yeah. yeah. I, I consider that even, you know, even though you, it's part of it's part of the divine too, bro. Not to do it again. <laughs> yeah, basically, you learned your fucking <laughs> lesson. Again. Again. I told you, I'm fucking don't do that shit it's again. It's basically the, the the super's an angel, I guess. Yeah. He told you. Fuck the super, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fuck, fuck the super, bro. <laughs> fuck the sucker. Nigga got me fucked up, bro. Yo, he facts. got me knocked the fuck out. That's the fuck. He got me. That's facts. That's facts. Yo, you ain't had, never had an yeah, interaction. Yeah, like, uh, yeah, yeah, I did. And it was on my senior year in high school, and I had, like, the, this principal, right? So his last name was Garcia, and we also had a dean. His last name was Garcia, too. Okay. So the way how we would, like, um, separate them was called one of them G1 and one of them G2. <laughs> G2. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so 
Um, so my senior year, it was just bad. Like, you know, I was going through a lot and everything, like situations with my mom and all that. So it was kind of fucked up for me in my senior mm-hmm. year. And I was getting in trouble. Like, I got suspended probably like three times my senior year, t- two out. times. <laughs> so it was like, so he pulled me aside one day, we in the office and we like, yo, um, like we just talking. He's like, yeah, like, you know, you fucking up, right? <laughs> I was like, yeah, I know. And then at that, like, he just asked me, he was like, yo, like, you want a job? Like, you want to, like, I could put you on to a job right now, which is going back to the supermarket job. But okay. that was, like, my first, first job. And in my mind, I was just like, you know what? Like, yeah, I, I would just take the job. I'm going to just take the job then. Like, okay. if you're telling me that you could give me a job, then I, yeah, I'm going to take it. Mm. So, you know, I just felt like with that situation, like, it just, like, me having a job, it really, like, took me out the streets. Like, you know, I wasn't, <coughs> like, if that I was, was purpose, still, yeah, if I was, if I was to still stay in the streets, you know, it probably wouldn't even have turned out good for me. So, yeah. you know, having a job, you know, actually being busy. Yeah. And actually making money, too. Like, that's the thing with a lot of people, like, that's, like, in the streets now. That's what's up. Like, yeah. you know, they don't really touch too much money to really understand, like, yo, there's yeah. really money out there, you yeah. know? So that's it's true. Just, yeah, that's it's true. Well, I like think they, they, they take a different route to yeah. get money, mm-hmm. right? So mm-hmm. they, yeah. they they could touch money, but the route they're going into yeah, to touch that money, right? Into, like, yeah. it's not a good route. That's true. You, on the other hand, yeah. what happened was, you know, you was getting in trouble, mm-hmm. getting into some shit out in the streets and all that, and yeah. boom, now... You you they offered you a job, da da da, and mm-hmm. right? Nah, it's just stupid shit like taking anger from my house and then bringing it to school. It's just yeah. just freaking to get into fights and shit. That shit was stupid. Well, so it happens. was like it made no sense. No, it happens. I mean, uh, I got one that he could he could test yeah. to, and I know you remember this shit. We went to go when you was getting into and him talking talking about him getting in trouble and all that shit. This is why yeah. I, that's a good thing you said there because just to segue into that oh, when yeah. you always getting in trouble when we we went to go. Deal with some shit. We went to go deal <laughs> yeah. with some shit, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we went to go deal with some shit, right? Yo, we went inside his place. It was, it was only, me, you, it was like five of us, right? Four or five, five of us? Yeah, two niggas in the front, two, two niggas, niggas in, in the back. back. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> niggas riding <laughs> stride. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, so it was only like four of us. We got, then two of us went somewhere, two of us, we just looking, we just looking for, they had, they after school, after, that day after school, they had um tried to jump him and his friend. Okay. Right? Mm-hmm. So, come on, like, I'm like, fuck it, let's just, fuck it, let's just go over there, like, this is another dumb shit. We, that's why we're telling these stories, because yeah. you gotta stay away from this stupid shit, yeah, right? right? Especially when other people cause it, just because my son doesn't mean that I need to just go do everything, or yeah. back him up for everything that he's fucking doing, because that's not the right thing. I also got other kids, and that's one thing that I had a conversation with him about afterwards, yeah. right? That it wasn't cool. And it's, it's a tough situation, too, like, for, like, for parents out there, too, because it's like, you know, you want to do... Like your best to try to like defend your child and mm-hmm. like be there for them, but at the same time, it's like, is it there's there's a there's a, a smart way to go about it, yeah. and there's a there's a, a dumb way to go. It's about it. not a, a dumb way, but it's always a gray area. In yeah, yeah, because you always want to go all out for your kids. So. And I was trying to go, I was trying to yeah. go stupid, bro, <laughs> stupid. But again, yeah. it was it was not the right thing to yeah. do at all, right? Yeah. So we went, but we was there for like a, a minute. We couldn't find nobody. So once we like, yo, fuck it, let's just call it a night. Let's go. Sure shit, when we was coming back, I saw a group, and I'm, I'm already on hot water, bro. Like, mm. you know what I mean? Because it, it wasn't the first time. Okay. It, it was already new, mo, new yeah. multiple times. We used to play ball in, in the schools and all that shit. They used to come fuck with him. It was already there, right? It was the yeah. detention. So I was like, yo, fuck it. We go, <laughs> and this, I said, yo, it was one of these niggas. Like, oh, yeah, it's one, it's one of them. <laughs> Backed up. Boom. He hopped out. Mm. We all got out. And, then, and I ain't gonna lie, bro. It was big niggas, <laughs> right? Yeah, like, it was like, yeah. There was like okay. two big <laughs> niggas, bro. Like, and and the rest of the other niggas, like our heads or shit. I, we ain't give a fuck, bro. Like, <laughs> we didn't, we came out with bads. That, the nigga they had, had the beef with, they came to fuck with, him, started booking him. This nigga booked it behind him, <laughs> caught him, <laughs> boop, <laughs> dropping him, pop. Niggas kept on getting up, trying to run. Mm-hmm. So I'm over here like nobody's jumping in, bro. I, I don't give a fuck who. Oh, one of the guys, oh, that's my student. That's my, I don't give a flying fuck who it is, nigga. Like, nobody. <laughs> So, he catches um guys run, the kids running through the fucking through between the cars. I know he he caught I think he caught he tripped or whatever shit. The nigga fell. Boom! I had a bat in my hand. Harry was there. Harry, you know you was there, bro. Yeah, shout out to him. Shout yeah. out Harry because he saved my fucking life, bro. He was there for a purpose. He was there for a purpose, bro. <laughs> Yo, he had him in the car. Boom! 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 So nigga, I'm a fucking and I I picked up the bat to swing on his legs, bro. Mm. I'm talking all my. Harry grabbed me, dude. He's like, yo, chill, chill. 
grabbed me, bro. I was trying to get that shit over. He's like, no, chill, chill, chill. He already had him. Yeah, there was no reason yeah. for me to do anything, right? Yeah, yeah. But he grabbed me, got me out of there. It may seem that simple that I just said it, right? Boom, mm -hmm. boom, got me out of there, cool. Next day, footage, footage. he got expelled from school, mm -hmm. got kicked out of school. Um, uh, um, they, didn't press, they didn't do anything because they didn't, they, I didn't do anything. Yeah. But if I would have done that and broke that kid's legs and all that shit, yeah. I would have been finished. I would have been finished. Yeah. I would have been finished. Why? Because there would have been other easier ways to do it. He would not got expelled if I would have took the right route to do it. Mm -hmm. Go through the school, um, do, do report, whatever the case is. But mm -hmm. me, mean street mentality and all that shit, trying to say, fuck that. I ain't mm -hmm. doing no fucking street report, no yeah. nothing. Fuck that. I'm going to go handle this shit streetwise. Mm -hmm. That's also why we That's what have, happens. That's also why we got to have good people around us too like that to like, you know, mm -hmm. take us out of the situation. Like, it's true. Like how he how, how he held you back, like yo chill. You know what I'm saying? It's that, true. That, 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 that should happen. That yeah, a lot of dudes will let that shit rock. Like nigga, like, what? He would have just let me go. Boom, yeah, nigga, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, he would have. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I, I thank God. For it. I tell him all the time. He knows that shit. Though, thank God. He's always saying like, yo, nigga, if I didn't grab you, no, thank <laughs> you, bro. Thank <laughs> you for doing it's that. It's true. Yeah. You know because what, where the fuck I would have been at right now? Yeah. You know what gets me too? Like, for for, the, for those people that like wouldn't like um. Like believe in anything at all, and they would just be doing a business. But then once that 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 something bad happens to them, now they want to oh thank God, mm -hmm. yeah, oh, thank, yeah, oh my God, thank yeah. God. But you know that's why because they never had the belief in God before. Yeah, that's why. So now when you get put into a situation, he never came down to tell you, yo, I got this. Yeah, he said basically, nah, you go ahead, bro, go yeah. ahead. No, they say it's luck. Oh, I got lucky. No. I get caught. No. I got lucky. Yeah. All right, like basically, divine intervention is not a thief stealing something. And he gets away with it. That's not divine intervention. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That motherfucker not. got lucky to the end of the day <laughs> to steal again tomorrow, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> If you really think about yeah, it, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So a lot of people got to make sure that you believe in him to actually get the help that you actually need. You know what I'm saying? Or that push that you need, you know? Because, you know, like what you said with, with Harry. Harry Harry was like an angel in disguise, he was, bro. bro. He that, was. That's another divine intervention. That's called a the theophany or some shit like that. If I'm not what pronouncing it. What is it called? Theophany. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, something like that. He's basically like a blessing in disguise. Mm. He's like an angel there blessing you. Yeah. He, came in an, he came in a human form and said, no, don't do this. Yeah. Stop. Yeah. Boom, boom. Yeah. That's divine yeah. intervention, bro. Yeah. That right there, he really, really spoke in the divine, bro. And I, that when you said that, bro, my hair stood up, bro. Yeah. Yeah. I had to stay quiet for a little bit because I had to cast myself because think about it, y'all. Like, yo, my man would have, like, his whole life would have nah, been yeah, done, stuff bro. Stuff like that. Like, and he was a minor, too. He was you know a minor, what I'm It would have been crazy, you know? So to have yeah. someone like that, that's what they always say. Always have an angel by your side, yo. You never know who they are because... Jesus comes in, di in, in different disguises. Angels come in different word, disguises. Word, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Word. They also said it, like when I looked it up, um, when I did my little research, right? Uh, not to go into religion real quick, but um, T.D. Jake said it too in, in, in the, the King James Version of the Bible where some people in Jerusalem said that Jesus wasn't real, that he was a stranger to them. But the man was walking next to them the whole time. Right. I'm blessing there. you right here, yo. I'm giving yeah. you bread. I'm giving you everything. You don't even know that I'm here blessing you. Yeah. Yo, you... We, sorry, could just to plug the show in real quick. Now that you're talking about that Jerusalem, I'm watching the show on on, on Prime right now. What's it called? Uh, Chosen. Oh, okay. Now nah, I heard about Chosen. the Vatican City. That's all. Nah, I nah, nah. Watch. I haven't watched all, but watch. Um, I think it's it's not the Chosen. Chosen. It's just Chosen. Prime. Amazon Prime. Watch Chosen, bro. It's all about Jesus. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's fucking. Fire. I'm on like season two right now. It's fire, bro. Like okay. he goes. He he was the dudes, but yeah. he, he can walk. Okay. Uh, um. He told me he walks amongst them and all yeah. that shit. Go check it out, Prime. Exactly, Look, exactly what chosen. I'm saying. Perf that's a perfect example, bro. See, chosen. so it's all about how you how you believe in yourself and pray to the Most High, man. That's I, all. I, I'll give you another one. I got stories, man. I'll give you another one. Listen, I don't know if you want. Oh, you got, got one right now. I got days. a story, but go ahead. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. All right, cool. You have story for days. For I, mm -hmm. I got one with this with this man right here, bro. <laughs> oh man, <laughs> I laugh now because it's fucking hilarious. Uh, now, right? But at the time, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh man. Uh. Listen, so we're taking a trip to Florida, right? We're taking down south, boom, keep driving, da -da -dum, da -dum, happening. Oh, now you told this, like, you told this already. The last episode. I yeah. did tell you this. I did tell you, <laughs> I did tell you this, but since we're talking about divine interventions, yeah. I just want to reiterate on it so y'all right, cool. can know, we could put it into content on right. what, what that was when I said it, right? Yeah. So, again, um, if y'all didn't watch it, go watch it, but I'll just say it right now anyways, <laughs> moving forward. Um, so he, so uh, we make, we did, a, we do a prayer. He wants to drive, right? Or whatever case. Okay. We put him to drive. He had his license or permit. I forgot what it was. What was it? It was a permit. It was a permit? Yeah. He had his permit. So 
It's like, fuck it. Let's put him to drive. It's daytime. I'm kind of tired. How old was he? Uh, like, 16, 15? Like 2019. Yeah. 19? I was like, nah, like he was like, fucking, was it 18? Yeah. Okay. 19? Okay, okay, okay. So, um, so we do a prayer. Boom. Father, you know, bless his drive. His <laughs> first time driving, whatever the case. You know, I said, go my, got my whole prayer thing going on. Cool. We laughed after that, right? Because we did say the prayer, but, you know, put some humor to the joke. You know, not a joke, but the prayer, but, you know, just to put humor. We driving. Cool. We into it. Mm-hmm. I kind of, like, fall asleep. I don't know how long was it into the drive before okay. this happened. Falling asleep. I hear my ear. Wake up. See? <laughs> Wake up. Yo, y'all don't believe me? Look. Look, that's word to my kids. I mean, I, I don't have to do all that so y'all can believe me. I just know what, what, what happened. Wake up. Wake up. So as the second time, I think second or third time I wake up, I get up, but shit was like slow, slow motion. Yeah. That when I got up, I, I'm looking forward. I see uh, traffic. Yeah. I look at this man right here. Yeah. This nigga's dazed out. Just like, just grabbing the <laughs> wheel, just, I'm like, in my head, I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with this kid? Like, I see he's not slowing down. <laughs> so, now to put all that together, it happened that fast. Wake up, wake up. Brrr, I grabbed the wheel, turned the wheel. We just missed the fucking traffic. Brrr, whatever the shit is, right? Damn. We pull over. My shit is like this, bro. Like, my fucking ass, my heart about to come out my ass, bro. Like, so I'm like, yo, what the fuck just happened to you? Da, da, da. I don't know what, he just dazed out. Like, I guess the road must have ate him up. Okay. Right? Because, and it happens. It happens. When you're driving lo- like too far, that's why I think it was, it was like into the drive a little bit. Okay. Cause yeah, I was like, you know what I'm saying? You're looking at like, he's not, he wasn't used to that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He wasn't used to that. So it's, it's me. And I just took a trip down there and it eats your road, your, your eyes up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So what happened? He said, like, yo, I don't know. He, at least he's like, I don't know what, what happened. Like, I must <laughs> like dazed off or something. But his eyes was wide open. Mm. Right? So I, my wife is in the back. Sit in the back, and I'm like, babe, like, you tell me to wake up? Because it was a female voice. Mm. I said, do you tell me to wake up? She's like, no, I was sleeping myself. I was like, nah, come on, bro. She's like, no, I'm dead out. I was, like, I was sleeping myself. I'm like, yo. I'll be honest, that was one of those days that if I, had a, if I ever had a question for him mm-hmm. of why, yeah. that, shit, that shit went dead. That's facts. <clears throat> yeah. That shit went dead because... To experience some shit like that and somebody, a female voice telling you, wake up, wake up, and this literally happened at all that, that time. Mm-hmm. You know when's the only time I hear that voice? When I'm running late for work. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this, I don't even, I don't even <laughs> hear that voice, nigga. <laughs> Yeah. Nigga, like, my ass be listening to music, <laughs> nigga. I'll be in my dreams like this, like, hey. <laughs> I'll be all doing the sprinkler Sorry. and all that shit. I nigga. hear that shit, bro. And I jump up mad quick from my bed, like, oh shit. Uh-huh. Who's that? <laughs> you turn around, got wifey sleeping all knocked out. <laughs> it wasn't her. <hard. laughs> <laughs> Hilarious. Like I said, the only time I hear that shit is when I'm late to work. <laughs> That's funny. Wake up. Wake yeah, up. Hey, listen. Yeah, hey, that it works. That's true, though. Yeah, but it's, 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 look, y'all always got to see that the chain of the vest, the, the things that happen to you, yeah, you have to be aware and put into perspective why it happened to you, how did you get out of it, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Why was it safe enough? I don't know, just, just the removal mm-hmm. from that piece right there that yeah. could have been crucial to you. That is what you got to not question it, but be grateful for it mm-hmm. and understand it, yeah. what that was. I feel, I feel like also being thankful for like even him, like or whoever, like whatever you believe in, like giving you that mindset too to like mm-hmm. actually like do that change or just That's get your get your life in the right in the right track. That's true. Yeah. True. Yeah. It could be a person or a fucking yeah. uh, an object or uh, anything. Yeah. Got to get you on the right path to make sure you it's good, man. It, it's scary, too, man, but go ahead, bro. No, I mean, I, ha- I, ha- I, got, I got more, man. I got I another ha- one that I, I want to g- fucking say, but go ahead, bro. I got a story. I got a story. I remember one time I was uh, hanging out, uh, chilling for a dead friend's birthday. A, a, a dead friend. He passed away. We were celebrating his birthday a year later and shit. Gotcha. And uh, we were all chilling on the block, you know, hanging out, drinking. You know what I mean? Loud music. I doing their own thing. It was about maybe about 50 of us. 
Next thing you know, we see a van just pull up on the corner. Everybody looking at him. Like, he's like, I ain't really paying much to it. Blast the music. Boom. Blasting the music. Everybody chilling, yeah. having a good time. So I remember I turned around, bro. Cause some something taps me. I don't know if it was a person or something. I turned around, some dude came out the car. It was an Astro van. You remember those Astro yeah, vans? Yeah, 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 yeah. My mom, my mom had one. Yeah, so it was one of those Astro <laughs> vans, right? And it was all black. It looked like they spray painted it. So homeboy comes out, or oh, you see something silver out his waist. Like a movie. Yo, that's worth everything I love. When it's like a movie slow, like what he like everything what he did in the car, slow motion. <laughs> that's what I seen when homeboy went woof. It started blasting everybody in the crowd. Pa, 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 hey, yo. pa. Yo, when I seen the flash, look, my hands are standing up right now, bro. Because when I seen the flash, me and Kels was there. We were chilling. So when I seen the flash, I told Kels, yo, yo, cuz, we got to go. Yo, I ran so fast, bro, that yeah. we ran past the 4-6 on Raya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On yeah. second. Yeah, yeah. Yo, we, were, we ran past the 4-6 right there. The cops is just looking at us. Oof, oof, oof. They <laughs> ran after the us. Is going on. Thanks, yeah. you know, they ran after us. Yo, get them. Do, 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 do. <laughs> bro. I ran, I ran, fucking Kells dropped. Boom, boom, boom. I was like, ah, oh, fuck. Man, I turned just, around, so I was like, they got the fuck, him, son. <laughs> they got him. Damn, son. They got Kells. My nigga, son. They got yo. Kells. I was like, yo, what am I going to do? So I'm like, ah, oh, fuck, fuck. I got to go back. So you know me, son. I went, went back? back. Yeah, I went back, back, my nigga. I went know. back. Yeah, you I went back. Know, you ain't know if that shit was a scene from a scary movie. What, like, what the son? Nigga just tripped. Nigga <laughs> tripped and everything. Yo, he tripped. Like a white girl in a trip. Ah, he, yo, Rick just it. like that, son. On the belly and everything, my nigga. So I'm like, ah, oh, man. Man, what the fuck? Yo, hear me up, nigga. Come he's on, like, son. like this, going back and forth. Like, just hey. like that, son. Double dutch in the <laughs> shit, bro. For real, son. Like, should I run? It's should like, I run with it? Yo, just like that, bro. Should I go? Should I stay? Should I go? Nah, I'm going to go back. I went back. Yeah, then we ended up getting locked up. Good nigga, bro. We got, ended up getting locked up. Question, you know, got questioning about the whole thing. But it was just the whole fact that something tapped me and told me, yo, turn around, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Turn around, bro. And once I turned That's around, I, I seen that shit, nigga. I skedaddled, nigga. I was like, I'm out, son. So nobody Pew. tapped you. You just... I just turned around, son. I'm telling you, bro. And I seen homeboy. Yo, I could describe everything that, about that That's day, crazy. Son. It's so vivid. It's not even fucking crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, so divine intervention is some shit, my nigga. <laughs> no, for real. <laughs> nigga said, Ricky! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> hey, I remember nah, that We shit, laughing so. now, man, but this shit is like... Yeah, I remember that shit like it was yesterday. Where so God man. sent the angel down and hit you with the... Yo. Tap one shoulder. You nigga looked the other way. Nobody was there. Nobody <laughs> was <laughs> there. <laughs> <laughs> I got <gotcha. laughs> Gotcha. <laughs> you say I got you for a reason. Yeah, like said, who tapped me? Yeah, who tapped me? Somebody tapped me, bro. <laughs> nah, but yo, that's crazy though, for real. And situations like that is crazy. Like, mm -hmm. and I don't know. It's just like being in the Bronx. Like, it's just crazy. Like anywhere else though. But like you know, like once you see that chrome, like it just has like that that flash to it. Like you mm -hmm. could see that shit from like a distance. That's true. Like, and you know what the fuck is coming out of that yo, shit. Yo, it's man. crazy. Like once you see that that metal like chrome is just yeah. ridiculous. Or yo. even the black Beretta f uh, carbon color. Yeah. Yeah, fuck that shit. Yo, so I, I, I'm gonna give y'all one more, right? Before we move forward, right? Give y'all one more, man. So, you know, I'm young, got my own apartment, boom, trying to throw parties, ah, ah, you know what I mean? <laughs> Do the perreo and all that, blowing <laughs> the walls and all that. That's how, <laughs> <laughs> right? So, this one day, threw a party, and the parties we, we, listen, the parties we used to go to or have, the house parties back then, people have house parties nowadays. I don't think so, right? Those shits were not. I mean, I'm I'm not in the street like when I was in a young. I don't but no, that's a good fucking. Question. You have house parties on days, like yeah. that age, they, like 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 for real, like like like, like they got cook, cook like home cooked uh, like I well I cooked the whole food and shit like uh, oh nah nah nah. Like no, no, I mean that, up and, nah, know, that's, that's the family house party. Yeah. Like that's, that's why, like hood house party. But oh. I like, the, I used to love those. Yeah, yeah food, nah, yeah. Don't even invite me nowhere if y'all got no food and no parties. <laughs> like, I swear. You know, like you're talking about, you buy some beef jerkies before you get here. Like, yeah, what, nigga, what you mean? I don't, don't want to be in no parties where there's just liquor, just weed. I don't want to be nah. eating no freaking... That's Told the parties we used to throw. I don't want to eat my fingernails for yeah. anxiety of wanting to eat some, nigga. You <laughs> fucking feel me, son? <laughs> Niggas is eating like that. Like, yo, when we going to go, so I'm starving, son. So much smoke in the fucking air, liquor and all that shit, and that's no food. You got to go out afterwards to go get food. Nah, bro. The Come lights on. fucking with you. You might just I pass like, out. Facts. Like, facts. That's a fact. So, <laughs> yo, so that's the type of party we used to throw, right? Cool. So there's one party I threw in my crib. 
whole hood came, bro. Like, everybody and their mother came. I'm talking about we had, like, over 200 people in that apartment, bro. It's a one-fucking bedroom apartment, bro. <laughs> I think I went there. You probably did go. Yeah, I think you I probably did. <laughs> Shit, I was like, everybody, everybody was there, right? So check it. So, liquor everywhere, da 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 You know, there's, there's, there's underage people there. Yeah. I'm, I'm barely only fucking 22, 23, like, you know what I'm saying? So, cool. So there's one thing. This girl gets fucked up. My cousin brings this girl to the to to the party and shit, right? She gets fucked up. Okay. So she's in my in my in my in my room, fucked up out in the in the, in the just throw up everywhere. She just done like she couldn't move. Period. Boom. Um, they had to call the ambulance. Ambulance came. The police came. Obviously, cause the party. A whole bunch of minors going across. Da da da. So now, cops like, Yo, who's own, who's the owner of this apartment? Only me, one of the shifts, obviously. Now they come over here, bow, put me in handcuffs, just off the rip. Mm-hmm. Put me in handcuffs. Bow, 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 bow. They were like, "Listen, I'm gonna tell you right now, if this girl don't make it, is 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 on you, because I'm the owner of the house, <laughs> bro." <laughs> Nigga, my heart dropped, my everything dropped, bro. Like, <laughs> I said, "What the fuck? <laughs> this is this is what happens." Like, and and obviously now knowing, yes. Yeah. You, that's your house. Wait, but I ain't trying to like wake up before calling nine one one. Yeah, we couldn't. She, she was done. She was no. She was no. I'm talking about finished. Like finished, finished. Yeah, I would have splashed a big bucket of water. Like <laughs> yeah, I took her to the shower or something. <laughs> something. But it wasn't. Ju- it wasn't just that. We could have splashed a big bu- bucket of water. She was not getting up. Yeah. She was. She already had like. She already had um, liquor poison and all that shit. Oh. They had to pump her stomach out. Oh. Damn. So when she, they took it exactly, they took it to the hospital. They pumped the stomach out. She was in the hospital for a few days. They had to pump her shit out because she had to think what the result was to it. Somebody dropped the e pill on her, on her drink. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It had to be <laughs> somebody dropped the e pill on her drink, and I'm not gonna say what I found out about it right here on this because it's already like over 20 something years. But I know what happened. I know who did it. So if y'all are watching, y'all know who did it, right? Let's just put that there, okay? So y'all can sit on y'all conscious now. Fucking cocksuckers. Right? Yes, yeah, pretty, pretty much. <laughs> cocksuckers, right? <laughs> so yeah, y'all could sit on that now, right? Because how the fuck did you set somebody up that's supposed to be your man's, mm-hmm. right? And not come up and say nothing about it, right? So if a nigga would have went to jail for X amount of years, yeah. nobody would have said nothing about it because everybody would have backed up from it. Because it was right? somebody else's dumbass mistake. Right? But it's cool. It's cool. Listen, God had a bigger plan for me. There you go. And he did it for y'all. Right, so thank thank God that Shorty was alive, and I didn't get into that. You know, we didn't have to go through all that process of it. But imagine she would have she would have just died. Off of, mm-hmm. You just you just you just that's spiked her drink. Up. You yeah, put an e pill on her shit, bro. That's some fucked up shit. Uh-huh. And my crib, why to try to take advantage? For right, what? like well, you ain't got no game, nigga. Like what you can't pick up. You don't know about the birds and the bees or Come something. On, you like, didn't have to put an epo. You could have <laughs> been drinking and, and, and kicked it to them. Yeah. That's already enough already. Exactly. Like a, a simple hello. That's it. You ain't gotta have to on, drop bro. some and try to take advantage. Yeah, like what type of person is you? So that so that's that fucked up shit right there. So God had a bigger plan for me. And again, after that, they kind of you know do no fucking house parties. I know better now. <laughs> Facts. I'm good with that. Was the last. Of the last, the me doing that shit. Fuck out of here, bro. Niggas gonna set you. How would I can't go to somebody's? You my man. I'm going to your crib. My nigga doing house, but I'm mm. boop. I'm also on some Pill Cosby shit. <laughs> <laughs> that shit's crazy, yo. That's some nuts, so, with, so with that, me like the spliff up because me are done with my intervention stories, man. No, that's true though, man. No, because but you know what's crazy, right? That some people actually wouldn't take what you your story like that and say that it was an, an a divine intervention. He'll look at it like maybe it was uh, 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 a, lo- uh, a law of nature that it just so happened. Uh, that, yeah. you, know, you know what I'm saying? That you it was your crib yeah. that it happened to. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of people out there. And that's what makes the divine intervention get fucked up, if you really think yeah. about it, because of people in that negativity. You know what I'm saying? Then they start, you know... Believing in uh, uh, things like the existence of God, if they, you know, because he's if he's a, if he's real or not, then you know 
They go against, like I said, the nature of laws of nature, the problem of evil. That's the thing, too. Yeah, because that person that spiked the drink could have probably been like, yo, damn, thank God. Like, <laughs> thank God that wasn't me. Yeah, thank God I didn't exactly. get in that situation. I was, I'm not locked up for that. But exactly. Knowing that he did wrong, though, you feel me? So it wasn't like, God that fucking yeah, made, made that, that helped you. Yeah, it's true. It wasn't God that helped you. Mm-hmm. Right. The devil because works. It works. Is, yeah. And mind you, it don't have to happen. Too. Nothing has to happen to you at the moment yeah. for you to feel that you that you repent from that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, word. Right? At the long shot, it's mm-hmm. going to come back. Yeah, All this is. dirty, fucked up shit you did at the time, yeah. it's going to come back. Oh, and I love how y'all saying this. You know why? Because that's why I was going to say this. Divine interventions versus natural law. Hey, get them. You like, know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's a big difference I'm because divine up. intervention is... About spirituality yeah. and religion, while natural law is about scientific methods. Yep. Yep. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like how you can like that's a big battle right there. If you really look it up, I'm telling y'all, man. Nah, nah, that's that's a fact. That's a fact. That's so a people get battle. shit misconstrued when they yes. say that, like yes. you know, oh, thank God, no, motherfucker, <laughs> don't thank God they you got away from it because you didn't. You just, it just happened. <laughs> you just, you you didn't. It shit is adding up to whoever's gonna come for you yeah. at the time. So, and this is why I always say, like, I feel like I live my, I outlive my bad karma, mm-hmm. right? Because of things like that. That's fair. Fuck that. And at the time, I didn't, I didn't know how to put that into perspective to say, damn, there's a reason why this, they did this. He did this. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, now I'm older, I can understand more. Like, I'm more, more you know, more knowledgeable of things. And I, you know, have different perspective on, 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 on certain things. That's true. Right, I lived uh, more life to to realize that. I agree with that one hundred percent. Right, so I'm the same way, bro. Right. Yeah. So I, you like, know. I like how your phone got like a little. Stand Yo, I just it. realized that I could use this, man. No, but he did not just say that. Yeah, I, that's serious. I just got. You this just phone. realized that you have I that, 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 that in the back. No, no, no. Meaning that I could use this now because I've been using oh. this fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> so like, I'm like, Yo, now nah, I could pull the phone closer <laughs> to me and be like, Yo, check this out, son. Yo, that's nah, crazy. Son, I just got this phone, man. Yo, anyways, my, real quick, son. We, we go with, we go with nah, that. Nah, yeah, so listen. So let, let's just, just a closing statement on, on if y'all, I'll, I'll say my closing statement on this. If, if, if y'all ever go through some shit that, that you know that it should not happen, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, wow, I should not have been here at this time. Or even a close call on, and this is another one real quick. I, I, I was going to be in the World Trade Center when that shit went down that same day. <laughs> no, no, jokes aside. I, my, yo, my dad called me at 8 o'clock in the morning. I'm supposed to be down there real, real quick. Right? I know I, I'm supposed to be down there 5 in the morning. It was election time. They were doing the, the whole election thing. 5 in the morning, giving out flies and all that shit, right? I overslept to like, like 6. 6 something. I was like, fuck, I'm late, bro. I'm not going down there. <clears throat> and I, I, I have no job at the time, so I could have just yeah. went down there and make some brown. Like, I'm not fucking going down there. Fuck that. I went back to sleep. My dad calls me like around 8, 50 something. When the first thing he's like, yo, you saw what happened to the world? I got out. I was like, nah, what happened? I look. Holy shit. Bro, I swore to my kids I was yeah. supposed to be down there that same fucking day that happened, bro. And I overslept that day. That's scary. So do we want to call it divine invention? I do because maybe I could have been alive. Maybe not. I'm not saying that I was going to be under the towers. <laughs> but yeah, you're still for me to up. be down there where the towers were at, and not be sorry for me to supposed to be down there, and not me not being down there was a blessing at, at itself. So, anyways, my closing statement to that is: if you have situations like that that happens to you, be grateful, be thankful. Don't don't ever question that man on what happens because he knows for the reason of why he's doing it and how he's doing it and when he's doing it. You understand? That is my closing statement. And if y'all want to think, we move nah, forward. That's just funny because my fault. Go ahead, my <laughs> nah, it's just funny because I feel like everybody has a story like that about nine eleven. Exactly. <laughs> like, like, yo, I was supposed to be there. Yeah. Nah, they were. They wasn't though. Yeah, they lied. They lied. <laughs> I was in school. Oh, like they even, like actually like really really remember like yeah. day by like moments, minute by minute how that day went though. It's crazy. Yeah, I agree with him. A lot of people say the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, cat. My closing <laughs> statement would be. Uh, yeah, I don't have one. No, nope, fuck it. <laughs> Close it up. Crazy. Let's go. Move forward. So, again, yeah. So, uh, what are we doing? Uh, current events? Oh, yeah. Current. Speaking of current events. Yo. Wait, show them your case first, though. Because yeah. like, that, that, that's, this pretty, is, that's this a pretty cool case. You could just Check this shit out, there. though, son. Oh. Oh, hell That no. shit like some freaking Iron Man this shit. Thing like, this thing is this transforming. <laughs> Opt- <laughs> Optimal. That, son. that shit is fire. Got kickstand. 
It, it, it's cool. I mean, I got a new phone, man. Yo, real quick, man. The whole week. So why do you have a fucking week. phone, bro? Like, this nigga on the chat all fucking week, bro. I'm over here cursing his ass out. Like, yo, this fucking job. Yo, fucking thing that it's there. funny that he did that, right? And I'm thankful for my man, Izzy. Yeah, son. he helped him out. Nigga said, yo, yo I think he, he said his phone is fucked up. Exactly. <laughs> said that. I meant, that was the first thing I mentioned, too. Yo, my phone's yeah. fucked up. I'm going to try my best to do what I can do. That was do. literally the day before, too. Oh, yeah, that's geez, the son. <laughs> Yo, I was so upset, bro. So you know what happened was, right? Monday night, right? I had dropped the audio already. Thank God I did that. Yeah. All right. Monday night, I go, I'm home, about to take a shower. I feel like being in the on B mood. So what I do is I put my speaker, Bluetooth speaker on. And then I got these racks for my soaps and shit and shampoos. So I said, you know what? I wanna I wanna read some lyrics, karaoke style, and go all out. You know what I mean? Well, I'm taking a shower. Is that from the top of your throat? OD. Hey, pause. Whoa. Hey, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> pause, yo. You wanted to have your own karaoke night in the OD, shower. OD, my nigga. Right? So, boom. I'm into the, uh, what is it? The, the 112 and the SWV song. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Going in it. I'm going in it. Then the fucking shit. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Then my phone wants to skip the song. I'm like, nah, that's not it. That's not it. So, I try to replay it. Water fell in my phone, son. Like... Mm. How you? How did water go in my phone? People look at me when I when I went to T-Mobile yesterday, and I told the lady that the, that she looked she looked at me like I had three heads, bro. Wait, so like, wait, wait how the water went in your phone though? Because I had it standing up, oh, right? Oh, yeah. So I'm reading the lyrics like this. So I try to swipe down, you know, to bring the the yeah. brightness on my screen and all that. Yeah. As I did that, a water drop from my fingertip fell into the speaker. <laughs> Oh, it just traveled. It just traveled home. all the way down to the motherboard, so bro. So what your mother, like what your phone started doing, it just it turned glitched. Off. Oh, wow. It's, 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 it's just turned off. That's it? You heard the sound effects, right? Yeah, yeah. Wow, <laughs> right? <laughs> Could have thought that we had got it from the board. But yo. Yeah, that's crazy. OD, nigga. So I went. Just that little drop. Just that little drop. So I literally went five days without a good phone, right? So I ended up finding my iPhone 6. Mm. <laughs> That's the same thing I did. I <laughs> chuckled when I found it. <laughs> so now I'm like, all right, let me try to activate this shit. Boom, boom, boom. I try to activate it. I could use the Wi-Fi. I try to make an outside call. Couldn't yeah. do it. I take it to T-Mobile. The nigga laughed at me. He said, what type of phone is this? This is an iPhone. He said, what type? I said, I don't know. He, said, he didn't like, even know. He said, <laughs> he said, oh, this is a six. I go, yeah. He goes, he goes, oh, we don't service this shit no more. <laughs> I can get the fuck out of here. He got goes, yeah, him. we don't do the service to these no more. I said, get the fuck yeah. out of here, son. So I was literally living off a Wi-Fi iPhone 6 for five days in the hospital and at home, and that's it. That was Yo. horrible. Mystery man all week. Yeah, and it's that crazy, too, because speaking about that, right, how how he said that, um, like, that they don't work with Apple, um, iPhone 6s no more. So Apple had came out recently, and it was like that they're going to pay out between, like, um, 310 million and 500 million to millions of users whose older devices slow down after software updates. Look at that oh, shit. Oh, the new software? The new one that came out? Because I just did my shit like the other days. Yeah. It's just, this one just came with it. Yeah, it did slow my shit down. Or maybe because my gigs are up. I don't know. Crazy. I don't know. I don't know why they say you got unlimited gigs, right? And then they give you 50 gigs a fucking month, and then they fucking text you. They want to tell you, you're up 48 gigs. You're up 50. What the fuck is my unlimited for then? <laughs> I don't fucking get that shit, bro. Like, that shit is just... Yo, I'll be honest. I'm about to leave T-Mobile, dude. Yeah, I said the and same I said, thing. And I told you that shit last month. <laughs> but yeah. I'm definitely... I already... Yo, I'm about to leave, man. I'm about to call, go back to AT&T or somebody. I'm about to go to, like, fucking Cricket or some shit. Simple Mobile. <laughs> yo, for real, right? <laughs> Come on, man. Like, Simple Mobile. Fucking the, Boost or something. Yeah. They support iPhone. So why not? Yeah, right. Yeah, so my phone, shit. my iPhone 11 is fucked up. I got a new one, though. iPhone 13. How was no, it though? Okay, like, how, you felt, how you felt like not having a phone for <laughs> throughout the week? Naked, so nigga. I felt naked. naked that's how so you know, but then bro. again, I, I, it felt good because sometimes you need a break. That's how you know we robots. Yo, great yeah. line. I ain't gonna lie to you. No, 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 I'm serious. <laughs> great line, bro. The, the bro, third yeah. day, the third day, I felt, I felt a little relief. Yeah. That's when I felt it. Like, you know what? And then when you got it back, it's your way you, you, you <laughs> Nah, you exactly. still, it still, yeah. Because it's always going to be like that little, like that little percentage of like of completeness course. you're going to feel like without your the whole, phone. Like the whole thing is, you said you said the third day you felt relief. We just programmed to be custom to something until it's not there anymore. Exactly. And then you get comfortable not having it because you started figuring out how to do other shit. So that's just what it is in human nature, bro. bro. Like, I'm on my phone when I'm smoking at night. Right. I'm either on Netflix or any yeah. type of show, whatever, doing a YouTube, Instagram, whatever. 
or promoting the, sh- the, the the podcast, right? Yeah, nigga, I couldn't do that. So now I had to pull out my coloring books, my comic books. <laughs> this nigga right here. I had to smoke and color at the same time. I yeah. had to smoke and watch and, and read. Uh, uh, what I got? Uh, the Flash comic book. You would lay down and p- pick your legs up. Color? Yeah, bro. I threw my legs up <laughs> against the wall. You know, yeah. like an L. You know, like an L. Not like, like on your stomach. No, no. no, lay on your stomach. Oh put your no, legs, put, no. Your, put your feet up. Nah, I didn't like get twink, that. Twinkle your feet. I didn't get that. Well, why are you coloring? Like, <laughs> nah. <yeah. laughs> Yeah, if y'all can picture that, just picture it. Laying on your stomach with your feet crossed like this. <laughs> yeah, Going back and forth with your legs. <laughs> just like that. I'm done. I can see Josh doing that, though. Like I would do that. <laughs> shit, I'd probably even lay on my side, nigga, and just Yo. probably do some shit. I don't Think know. Uh-huh. Just a, like that. And then you get a call from somebody like, your underwear you got on? <laughs> <laughs> Or what socks you got on? Like what? Yeah. I told him those, those those blue Oreo ones you like. Yeah. <laughs> yo, I'm dead, bro. Yo, anywho, anywho, yo, did, did y'all see? Did y'all hear about the fucking the 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 story of the um, what's that movie? Um, the the Blind Side. Oh yeah. Oh, you mean crazy. the Blind Sided? The Blind Sided. <laughs> <laughs> the Blind Sided. Yo, that story is crazy. But it's like out of all these years, now you coming out with the real story. Cause now they're saying now they saying that he wasn't really um like adopted, right? It was nah. it was, cor- it was a conservative shit. Conserv- yeah. That shit that Britney had. Yeah. Yep. And he crazy. and and he wrote a book back in two thousand and one or twenty one stating that uh he wasn't in conservative shit with them. Yeah. So he fucked up on that. You can't come back right now and fight it against yeah, it because right. you wrote it in your book. Like, I don't understand. Why would you? Like, now you want to sue them for everything they've made behind it. Why? Because they made so much. I don't know. But they, they didn't. Of the movie, they didn't. So they, they say. They allegedly. Only, uh, allegedly. But they only made $17,000 each person in the yeah. family. But that movie made, what, wow. 300 mil? It's true. Yeah. But the f- reason why the family is so rich is because the dad had uh, sold his business. Mm. And it was a multi-million dollar business. So what he ended yeah. up getting back from that business was it like in the hundreds of oh, wow. millions of dollars? I don't know, man. I can't. I can't really see you getting. I this. I, I don't know the facts on this part, right? Because we don't know yet. But I cannot see somebody getting seventeen thousand dollars off a movie based on their own story, their life story. Yeah, their life story. Like that's they probably didn't read the contract. <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe, maybe. But they fucked them heavy. Then if that was the fucking yeah. case, yeah. that means the family was not smart enough. If they that yeah. rich mm-hmm. with companies and rest, they were not that smart. I don't know how the fuck they got into that space if you can't even fucking get a lawyer's and to see a contract to say seventeen thousand is I mean, worth but, but that but much to sell my but think about this it guy's though. story. But think about it, seventeen thousand dollars plus the endorsements that he made through the whole football career that he had, because he did bless the family while he was playing. Yeah, but let's okay, but let okay, cool, I get that, but that's aside from the movie itself. A contract from the movie itself. Right? Whatever endorsement he did on that shit, yeah. that's beyond that. But a movie on my lifetime, I'm gonna go, yo, if you made this much, I'm yeah. only gonna. They paid me up front. Say, yo, here's 17 for each of y'all. That's it. We own the rights to the story. Like, nah, we ain't doing that. <laughs> and for them to have in that space of being rich or yeah. having company, you right. That was not like yeah. that smart to be nah, like, yo, it's too late. It's too, you know, late. Oh, it's too late now for <laughs> sure. But they had to make some type of money off of that shit, yeah. or percentage, or points on on, on 300 mil. Yeah, that movie did a lot of numbers. And you only did, got it seven. Did. Nah, it bro. Did. It did. Who, who's it? Is it from? Uh, Warner Brothers. Okay. I thought it was Disney. Because I was about to say, you know how Disney likes to twist some shit <laughs> <laughs> in their movies. That's crazy. Yeah. That's but it crazy. is Warner Brothers, though. So I was like, all right, cool, cool, cool. But that that's some shit, though. Because I really thought that whole story was really like. Yeah, it was like it was like a very touching movie, yeah. like a, a crazy yeah. story. Sandra bro. Bullock like, won some know. awards off that shit. Come on, bro. I like that movie, bro. That's I really fucking dope. love that movie, that's dude. Where, that's where all the money really went to. Uh, yeah, we know that. To so Sandra Bullock, the actors. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe. Maybe yeah. that's crazy, man. Like, but hey, listen. Yeah. I mean, y'all, if y'all want to watch that movie, sorry, okay, go watch. It's a good movie. Yeah. It's definitely a good story. The story doesn't lie. It's not a the, the story is not a lie. Mm-hmm. The, the whole adoption is, but yeah, it's a conservative shit. Yeah, but the story itself, how he, how he, it wasn't a lie. How he made it, how he went, that was all true. It's just so it's, it's a good story. It's sad because the homeboy haven't been playing since like what almost yeah. thirteen years. Yeah. He's broke. He broke. He ain't got no joke. He broke. Yeah. There ain't no joke. I know that for a fact. Yo, what's okay. so well? <laughs> what you ever got? For you, what was the craziest thing you ever got for your birthday, bro? The craziest thing I ever got for my birthday. Or the funniest for your birthday? 
I got a card. I got a card from my wife, right? And it was cool, though. It had money in it. So I was thankful for that. Um, I had a, a scratchy thing. You okay. know, like, so you scratch the first th- one, right? Okay. It says, um, scratch the next one and win a blowjob. So hey, yo, okay. Shit, that's what's up. <laughs> you know, my, what the Hi. fuck is this? Let me scratch the second shit. one. Yeah. It's all good. So I scratched the second one. I said, ooh, you're close there. Scratch the third one. You're <laughs> almost there. So I said, ah. So I was like, I don't know if I should scratch that third one. So I said, fuck it. Let me scratch. I scratch. You know what the fuck shit said? Try your luck next year. Happy birthday. <laughs> Yo. Yo. I was like, damn, baby. Son. I thought it was really intimate. You know, I thought it was Bro. really intimate. I got really into <laughs> it. You know, I, I was like, damn. You know, I thought I was really going to get some, some shit that night. Yo, bro. Yo. That was not. <laughs> I would have burnt that nah, car right I there, I would have been mad curious, though, too. Like, Yeah, bro. Just got to try to one. <laughs> just looking around. I would have been tight at the end, bro. Like, yeah. try next year. What? Happy birthday. Nah, and I'm should, like this. This I, shit is I, happening. Fuck this. I literally dropped the car down. I look like, like a little kid in a toy store and get no toys. That's fucking hilarious. I would have went up to like, baby, serious? This is what we doing? <laughs> <laughs> it's so this is the bobs we on right yeah, now? You just kill my shit. You, Why you, you, just you better be like, joking. You gotta be joking. You better be joking. To stop playing. <laughs> nah, I would have been laughing though. Dude. I nah, been I had me like, dying though. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it was cute though. I was, I was like, I got you. I, I got love you. Jokes like but that, like but is this for real though? That's yeah, yeah, yeah. Now nah, you, you bugging. This <laughs> ain't for real, right? You, ain't, you lying about this, right? <laughs> That's when they give you that smile. They be like, yeah. And then nighttime comes. <laughs> Gone. Yo. I'm dead. I'm dead. Gone. <laughs> hey, don't do that. Don't do that. No, I, you know, I, I asked because, right? But you ever got something funny? Because I asked because, yeah, yo, you, like the normal shit. You, 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 you ever see, you, you see what, what, what Drake sent Fat Joe for his birthday? <laughs> what he sent them? The, a pair of socks. A socks? A pair of socks. Yo. With his face on it? Yo. Nah, it just says, it just, it just says, uh, socks for Joe. Some shit like that. Really? Right? Yo, to be honest, though, to be honest, right, the older I get, I'm starting to appreciate gifts like that more. Like the socks, the underwears. Like, yo. Off a rich nigga like that? Yeah, it's a thought that counts. A pair of socks. If they 100% kind or Satan, then I'll take it. I'm pretty sure they probably want some good fucking socks. Yo, listen, it's the thought that matters. It's the thought that matters. No, no, it is the thought that... Listen, don't don't (laughs) get me wrong. I don't want to take that away from you. Yeah, but the thought goes away away fast. When when you got a $100 million house, bro... No, I want a gift gift. Like, you ain't I sending want, me no fucking I want no, you to no know, socks, bro. I want you to think about it later on and be like, damn, I really spent that money on this, man. A pair of socks. Nah, oh, man. No, now the money, thing is, man. are you are you joking now? Are you mocking me? Because now I'm going to take it as now I'm gonna take it as a funny thing like that. You t- oh, you, oh, you, yes, you, you're, you're a funny nigga. Nah, that was a funny move by him. You know why he got them socks, but though. But that's right? why, That's though. what I want to know. I don't know. I don't because, know. Right. I haven't been on social media all week, so I'm lost, guys. Ah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Drake, I'm serious. Because, right, he has, Drake is a person that has, like, a lot of, like, billionaire celebrity friends. Okay. So, he, bro, he be getting crazy shit, like freaking Pharrell's old chains from back then. Oh, like the Tupac ring. Yeah, the Tupac oh, ring. Oh, okay, yeah. I got you, I got you, I got you. Too. So, Fat Joe seen that, he was like, yo, how come I don't have no friends like this? You know, <laughs> like, I don't get nothing from my friends. Like, so, he was like, nah, all, all my friends got to step it up. Hey, it's true, though. So, I guess CJ heard that and was like, you know what? I'm going to just send him a pair of socks on some funny shit. On some funny shit, bro. Like, at least I'm that friend that is the thought, you know? <laughs> send you stuff. That's, you sound like he'll say some shit like that, too. So, that's just like the words he'll probably he say. He wore it, too. He threw <laughs> pictures on it. He, he threw pictures with the sock, like, mad close up. Funny shit, bro. Hey. Funny shit. So, I, if, if that was a joke, it was a joke, pretty much. That shit was hilarious. But, hey. You got to love that, man. Not, not from a nigga that owns, got a $100 million house. <laughs> Yo, word up, son. Fuck that up. shit. And flying and flu- and flu- and flu- and girls Supposedly out. Supposedly his plane, they gave it to him too. Oh, I don't know how true is that, allegedly. It's Canadian people, I guess. Yo, for real, they said his plane, they gave it to him. They like, gave it to all oh, yeah. Uh, that's crazy. Uh-huh. That's way crazy. That's, cr- yo, how many favors do you owe? <laughs> how many favors did you owe? <laughs> how many favors do you owe? I mean, fuck, bro. Yeah. That pl- then he got a, his own fucking jet OVO. Wait, 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 he goes, uh, he, he got the, a two bedroom the, the, on that bitch. He got the Virgil shit too, the off white one with the but with the clouds. Come on, bro. Shit is crazy. Come on, bro. This I nigga. Want, I want friends like that though in the future. You me know? too. Listen, listen. <laughs> this is hey. Yeah. But also send me a pair of socks too here and there though. Like whatever. 
Like, you know how people ask you, like, Yo, what you want for Christmas or, or for your birthday? Like, Yo, just give me a pair of socks and boxes. Bro. Okay. Anything else I could get myself. Like, I'm going to be honest, bro. Gift. Not me. If I had shit, bro, like, <laughs> I, no, if we, if I'll, let's take, say, I'll take a t shirt. Let's <laughs> say if we was like millionaires, bro, I would love, nigga, he's a rolly, nigga, like, that yeah, like also I'm the why why not, bro? Yo, if you my if you my man, yeah, man, yeah. like fam, yo, nigga, he's a rolling for your birthday. Here you go, yeah. bow. That it wouldn't mean shit to me. Yeah, word. Yeah. Like these celebrities be buying these chains. Joel, and Come on, bro. Yeah, Joe, like Joel and Beat. Um, now nah, who was it? I think it was James Harden who got Joel and Beat uh, like a Rolex or something for his birthday. Come on, that was nothing to him. Yeah. A roly, maybe a tax write off, but hey, a roly <laughs> yeah. though. Like, come on, you think about you that. pay 15, 20, yeah. 30, whatever kind of roly. I don't know, but yo, you give me a 15, up. Yeah. <laughs> damn, yeah. nigga, you must drip. love me, nigga. It's the drip, you must love me, nigga. Yeah. Must have did something nice. Shit. I must have been nice. Yo, yo, did y'all see that, that, that random ass ball link up though? Of freaking Barack Obama, Toby, yes. Toby oh, yeah, Maguire, yeah, 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 George yeah. Clooney, and freaking Don um Chino. How you Don say? Chino, Chino. Yeah, that's so, a dope mix, though. I would love to see. Talking that. about talking about uh, uh, um, we don't get back talking about ball link up. What's up with that with that uh, that tournament? Oh yeah. So for those of y'all who don't know, we got a um a back to school tournament for all the kids out there, and it's going on September third. And we're gonna have um four teams, four or eight teams there, and we're gonna be ball in there. Whoever wins gets a trophy. We're gonna also have school supplies for the kids, like book bags, notebooks, um pencils, and yeah, food there is, o- is also gonna be where, food. Where's gonna be at? Um, in Pelham Parkway. At I, I, um, I, location, I'll put it up here. Yeah, location is to be announced. We we, we don't really know yet. So, but it's, gonna, it's gonna be in the Pelham Parkway area for sure. Oof, that sounds fun. That's yeah. fire. That's fire. Yo, so listen, I'll put it up. You know, um, we'll put the information. Like you said, just stay tuned with, with the Instagram. Yeah, it's for a, the kids. A, as they as they announce the 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 location, right? But yeah, man, back to school, book bags. You know, hey, everybody don't got. You know what I mean? That's that's a good fucking give back. But check it out. Stay tuned. So yeah. with more information, sponsored right? by the Off Experience Podcast. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Go to the link up. Yeah, that link up was funny as fuck, bro. bro like, imagine, yeah. imagine you just walk into the gym and you just see them. That's wild, random. Like, but where were they playing at though? Here in New York? No, I'm not CB, sure. CB, I Berkeley? Think it was like a gym. But it just looks weird. The picture looks weird, bro. Like, I know, but I mean, that'll be cool to watch. No, though. which is fine. Listen, which is fine. You can smell the money in that. Room. Imagine all of them like playing like they movie roles and and while that's crazy. <laughs> I guess I I seen a thing like that. I forgot. I, I'm. I don't want to say what it was. Like Toby, Toby Maguire is like <laughs> with the yeah, yeah. with his Spider Man skills. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Don Cheeto and his uh, War Machine skills <laughs> and all that. <laughs> That'd be crazy, bro. Like, imagine playing ball with them. Yeah, that's Obama. fire. That'd be yeah. fire. I mean, Adam Sandler and J Cole was just downtown in Manhattan playing ball. Adam Sandler oh, yeah, could ball, bro. Yeah. And randomly just popped up at the park. You know, like, yeah, yo, I'll meet that. you there. All right, cool. They ran up, really met up. there. Yeah. not together, but they met up separately. That's fire. That's and they said, yo, we gonna play right here somewhere downtown. I think so. Uh, that's fire. Yeah. Yeah. So got, drop a ball for that. Adam Sandler be playing ball in like a button down and some long ass yeah, shorts. He, he, Adam like, Sandler, he's definitely <laughs> listen. Adam Sandler for real, bro. He's Tim's. a real nigga. With Tim's on. I was just watching Billy Madison the other day. That shit is yeah. hilarious. My penis. That's one <laughs> dude, man, that, yo, he's us. Yeah. He's <laughs> us. Yeah. He is, definitely. He's us. Yeah. His he, movie's just movies, but he's us. He even showed up at the door at, a, at an award show with a button down. <laughs> a regular a regular polo shirt yeah, and pants. And pants. You gotta love it, man. You gotta I love think it. I think that was the Met Gala, if I don't mistake. <laughs> Look at that. Met yeah. Gala at that. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's him, bro. You gotta love it, man. You gotta love Word. it. Yeah, it's him. He's that geyser, son. That's why New York, you see all this type of shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Tell me about it, but I just seen a, a like a a freaking crackhead on a bike holding <laughs> up a, a couch like with his head. Nah, I believe it. <laughs> yeah, I, I see, believe yo. it too. Bro. I seen an African guy hold a TV on his head. Like, <laughs> like how does that even get up there? Like, how do you guys, uh, like, bro? It's crazy. When you gotta bro. get it. You gotta get it. That's good. When you see them niggas in the trains, bro, and the trains bringing in the yeah. sofas, the sofa set. The love seat and the fucking and, and, and the whole <laughs> the big sofa, bro. The couch, yo, you in this, you in the train yeah. delivering sofas, bro. Like, yeah. shout out to y'all, man. Y'all wild in New York for real. <laughs> that, that, that literally just goes right back to what we were talking about at the very beginning of the episode. Everyone has a purpose. Yeah. <laughs> yo, listen. Seriously. Shout out them. Shout out yo. them. I gotta get this shit to the Crips, and I don't care. I ain't got By no money for no necessary. U-Haul. Oh, but the U-Haul 1999. You got that 1999 for me, sir? Nah, bro. 
Nah. I'm taking this couch on the fucking two train, <laughs> nigga. Take the shit apart. Carry the legs, bro. Yeah, I'm dead. Carry the legs. You you carry one thing, I carry the other. We out, son. So, yo, I'm te- no, they ain't got no nobody credit card. We good. No license, nigga. We good. Mm-mm. What? No, nigga. We good. Mm-mm. Train. <laughs> we in there. Mm-hmm. Shout out. Shout out to them. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. I mean, there's always somebody like he said, crackheads or the uh, undomicile undom- nah, people. Crackheads do it. Yo, crackheads do it. The undomicile people. We don't call them crackheads, y'all. Come on, son. No, we call them. We call them. The undomicile people. The undomicile. People the people who are the like. The fuck not does really that mean, there. bro? Like, people who are not. How you even spell that? How you? Exactly, I don't know what the <laughs> fuck that. I never heard that, bro. This is the first. What is it again? Yeah, undomicile. I think that's how I'm saying. Undomicile. Right. I don't know how you say it. So undomicile. Yeah, there's homeless people. No, no, no. We're talking about crackheads. Uh, I don't talking about crackheads. Like, which one? We're we talking about crackheads. They are homeless, though. Nah, crackheads. All crackheads ain't homeless. <laughs> you right. All crackheads ain't homeless. Bro. Some crackheads actually have a better house than you, me. That's a fact. You. They got luxury shit in nah, there, yeah. but they yeah, like yeah. to spend other people's money. Nigga, you don't see these niggas like outside asking for money or shit. They got nice cars parked around the corner, bro. Yeah, you know what I realized though. Get the like, fuck out of here. Like, <laughs> I realized that everywhere you go, like different states, like they crackheads is different from all. Nah. Like, <laughs> he's right. Like, yeah. Like yo, it's so different. Like I don't yeah. know. Like our crackheads is just more like they just be looking more fiend out, like yeah. fucked up. I go to like places like Florida. It's just like they just I don't know. Like they just more to themselves, but they just homeless like. I don't but know. you can see the holes in their face though more uh, the sun. Yeah, like, they're not begging for people for really. They just on some. It is what it is. Crack him, this is uh, my life. This is my life. You know what? It's different. Watch, this bro. Is my life. Compare crackhead from New York and then go. Now down he got to me like trying Miami, to analyze this shit now. Like. Go down to Miami and see a crackhead. It's like that's man, crazy. It's very different. That's a crazy analogy. I mean, I don't think observation. I don't think that's crack though. They make that bath salt. They probably got that fucking yeah, crystal. Uh, that Maybe math? the drugs, yeah. Right? Yeah, that math. Yeah, no. Hey, listen, I don't know. Stay Anyways. away from <laughs> drugs. <laughs> Let them know. I mean, wait. Uh, that's kind of like, what? Wait, we smoke weed? Nah, that ain't <laughs> drugs, bro. Listen, <laughs> first of all, talk about this. Um, I am very legal, by the way. Oh, excuse me? I just want to throw that out there. Let's I give it there. I am very legal. Like, from, literally. From the New York State, I do have my license now. My medical card. My cannabis card. So, thank you, um... So What's the benefits I, behind that though? Like, if you get that you're legal, buddy. To do what? Like to to your job can't question you if you do it two year two hours before that they cannot question you at all. You could be safe from that unless you are acting out of the unordinary at but then, the but job then they, place. Yeah, but then they gotta prove that that's based off that. Yeah. So it's, it's you have a lot of legal things. They can't just be like, oh, you nah, nigga. Boop. But remember Hold though. That. But remember though, if you, you some people got to realize that you can't do that, right? But you got to remember that sometimes in jobs, job descriptions, like in the fine print of it, it says that the management can't give you any job. You, yeah. They can that you're fix right. you that you're you right. might not have to do, yeah. right? So now, right, you're doing something that you're not used to doing, and you just smoked the blunt two hours ago. And now they looking at you and you're like, well, why are you leaning like that, son? <laughs> I know. I mean, listen. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's how they start thinking, like, wait a minute. I could get this nigga for this. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. you got to look at it from a managerial point of view. You know well, how much are you? But, uh, right. But there's, there's, there's stimulations to all that, right? If before two hours, mm-hmm. you can only. It's like liquor. Yeah. They, they, they equivalent to liquor. Like, oh, yeah. you would have to be mm-hmm. this high above uh, a certain amount. So they could be like, okay. Boom, we got you on that. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. it's got to be a lot. It's got to be shit to it now. Mm-hmm. Before you, oh, this nigga look, nigga, you out it? Nah, nah pop, yeah. hold that. Like, this, this, the same shit got rule for liquor. Same shit got rule for that. It's true. And I'm, I go to the 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 the, dispensary. the dispensaries. I don't have to go to the 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 recreational dispensary. Mm-hmm. It's different mm-hmm. when you go to the medical one. So like, does that car like travel with you like out of the state? Like, I, you can I, use I, it anywhere. I mean, you no, know, in Puerto Rico, you have to re. Oh, I know PR. We have to re uh, readmit your card to the Puerto Rico one. Do you? Uh, yeah. Right. If if you go like visit, yeah. Really? Mm-hmm. All right. So I, I didn't. I, that I, I didn't know. Do, I try to do that. Right? Yeah, yeah, but not yeah. But you go anywhere. Like yo, you show your thing anywhere out of state. That's dope. That's cool. So, and you get, uh, 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 um, how can I say, not tapped in fucking shit. Like I mean, I do. We do get our shit from outside, but. <laughs> it's a little more expensive Dis- dispensaries. Dispensaries. Yeah. dispensaries. I'm actually about to go to one soon too. But you get Dispensary. good quality, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. Known quality. You know that's that, right? Yeah. And it's not it's not hit with other shit on it. So with your license, can you buy other people's stuff? Or how much weight uh, can you I, carry? Yeah, you asked me a question right now that I yeah. don't really too much thing, but <laughs> I can grow in my in my house too. Okay, but how uh, as much as only what three ounces? Uh. 
You know, I should I should I think, but it's it's yeah. a couple of ounces. I think it's six ounces. I might. I, I could grow that shit. And they can't yeah. even say nothing to me. Like, I mean, listen, I'm legal, baby. Jump <laughs> off me, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I right. told these niggas go get it, bro. From get hiding, shit. From, from hiding your blunts in the streets from the cops and now being legal. Right? Listen, and <laughs> now, right, and I work, I, I work for the city, right. So now, if I'm walking around, yeah. yo, you want to stop? Yo, bow, hold on, man. <laughs> yeah, it's legal now. I can walk around with it, but bow. Forget about everything else. I got extra coverage. The cops be on some fucked up shit. Though. If I look at that shit, like, the fuck out of here. All right, that's cool. <laughs> What's daddy gonna do, man? <laughs> 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 hey, listen, fuck it. It is, but. Who's gonna come out on top? Yeah, right. That's true. Booyah! You, you got lucky. Got it. Got, all right, so anyway, you lucky. <laughs> lucky. Look at this nigga was lucky, bro. <laughs> no, bro, it was meant for me to get it, bro. You right. You I was in a it. barber shop, bro. This is how it came about. I was in a barber shop. This dude walked in like, yeah, we talking about Bud, how he gets fucked up. What well, we talking about Bud, shit, right? <laughs> no, nah, barber shop talk, me. So he's like, yeah, man, I got my car. Like, damn, how you got your car? He's like, man, he's like, nigga, it's easy, bro. Like, man, go here to this website, da da. Man, apply for it quick. You get, you get a, you get yeah. a proof in a few minutes, bro. It's New York doctors. Legit doctors, okay. they approve shit. Mind you, they still they want us to fucking spread the room, the, the news, right? So listen, I'm gonna tell y'all with a with a with a fucking uh, the plug. You know what I mean, I heard Eric on um, like Eric Adams is not jacking like all the weed smoke being in the air. You don't like that. They, they, they saying it's getting too much now. Yeah, and well, they, they say statistically wise, New York City has become <laughs> the state that has the most consumed air. THC quality. Normally. That's that's good air right there. <laughs> Listen, so y'all could go check out nugmd.com. Nug M D N U G G M D dot com. Boom. Apply there. Hey. <laughs> that fast. All right. Let them know. Is you know, it's anxiety. Yeah, send me that link too. I got gotcha. you. I'm gonna put the link too on, on, on the description, right? Exi- is, you can tell them ex- you for anxiety. Uh, um, stress, right? You got a little pain in your in your back. Ah, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, uh, um, insomnia. Okay. Minutes. You Minutes. approved. Mm. Booyah! Drop a bomb for them. Thank you very much. So, what are we doing, guys? Moving forward. Yeah, that yeah, being said. Oh, my bad. <laughs> moving forward. No. Or we no. With that being said, right? <laughs> Please don't forget to like. Share, subscribe. <laughs> also Bing. catch us on Instagram, <laughs> Experience Pod. You yes. know, we also gonna drop our personal pages down there as well. Yes. In the download in the bit, um, description. Yes. Um, stickers too. Yes. You know, they're Check out there out. now. You know, yes. also not only here in New York, there's also gonna be in other places. Okay. Ooh. Okay. I'm not gonna say it. Y- y'all gonna see those. Okay. Don't you know, just, just, just listen to your, to your city near you. You know, if you catch it there, you catch it there. You know what I mean? Mm. With that, peace, bless, love. Give thanks to that man above. Live, love, prosper, y'all.